Hello friends, in this video we are going to discuss about the wiring of DCP10 of the Wilson module. In previous video I have told you about the function of these buttons and how to set the parameters in DCP10. I will share the link of the video at the end of this one. Now we are going to discuss about the wiring. Number 1, 2 and 3 are the phase of generator voltage number 4 is the neutral 5 and 6 these two points are not used then comes the 7, 8, 9 these three are for generator ampere you have to connect it with the CT or current transformers number 10 is common for the current transformers or CTs number 11 is for oil pressure and number 12 is for coolant temperature number 13 is for remote start how to wire up a remote start I have told you in a previous video number 14 and 15 are user configurable digital inputs. number 16 is for charging alternator 17, 18 and 19 are the user configurable outputs you can configure them in the parameter settings I have already made a video on how to set the parameters in this module I will share the link at the end of the video number 20 is positive 5 volt 21 is crank 22 is fuel 23 and 24 are battery positive and battery negative 23 positive 24 battery negative you have to connect the battery voltage at B positive and the ground wire at B negative. Remember 5 and 6 are not used in this model. These outputs are user configurable from the parameter settings. The oil pressure and coolant temperature are the sensors which are giving the resistance at the number 11 and 12 with increase in resistance the voltage or the value of oil pressure and coolant temperature decreases that is how it works thanks for watching the video